It's here at 11. I'm Jamie Costello. That shooting happened near the Dunbar High School Stadium. There was a game going on inside between Dunbar and Loyola Blakefield that was canceled mid game right near the half. WMAR 2 News Ashley McDowell is out there live for us tonight. Ashley, tell us what's happening there. Well, Jamie, Baltimore police say it was a 12 year old boy that was shot. I spoke with Dunbar High's head football coach, Lawrence Smith. He tells me the shooting did not happen on the field, that it happened across the street, and it sent the coaches, players, and the crowd scrambling. It was just before halftime at the game between Dunbar High School and Loyola Blakefield High School when gunshots were heard. We were in the middle of the game, great atmosphere, good first night of the season, and we heard gunshots. And then everyone just started running, and athlete. The players got down on the field and everybody started running on the field. Baltimore police say it was a little after seven when the shooting happened. Officers immediately located the 12 year old boy. Dunbar's head football coach, Lawrence Smith, says a lot of parents already feel it's unsafe for the kids to play at a field that's in this location and that this just confirmed their fear. I always have to talk to a parent about when a kid want their kid to come to Dunbar and when I want their kid to come to Dunbar and when I want them to play for me at Dunbar. And it's never about the football program. It's never about the academics. It's always about the neighborhood that Dunbar is in. So I wanted to apologize to them and let them know that I'm sorry because it's right now with this happening, they are right and I'm wrong. They were right because they worst fear came and happened tonight of a shooting or something happened at that stadium while that child was playing. Police say the child was transported to the hospital and is currently stable. In downtown Baltimore, Ashley McDowell, WMAR 2 News. Uh -huh.